Today I'm going to tell you about two ways to prep your concrete floors before you apply pebble paving, epoxy flooring, or anti-skid. The first way I'm going to show you is with muriatic acid. You can get muriatic acid at your local home supply store. There are a couple things you need to know about it. One, you need to use the proper safety gear. It comes with instructions on the bottle. Our specific muriatic acid says it's 25 parts of water to one part of muriatic acid. And we're gonna clean this small concrete block so we only need a small amount. The two main reasons you would want to use muriatic acid to clean your concrete floors before applying an epoxy coating is oil stains or stains of any type or to etch the surface for a better abrasion when you apply the coating. The first thing I'm going to do is get my safety gear. These are acid resistant gloves, safety goggles. This is a regular surgical mask. Get them anywhere. This is a respirator that you can use to help with the fumes. Today, since we're using such a small amount of muriatic acid, I'm going to go ahead and use the surgical mask. You, of course, want to follow the instructions on the back of your bottle. The first thing I'm going to do is put on my mask and my glasses, and then I'm going to put my gloves on. We pre-mixed a little bit of muriatic acid with water. Our muriatic acid said to do 25 parts water to one part of acid. You're going to go ahead and pour it really close so that it doesn't splash. You're going to let it sit for about 30 seconds till it starts to bubble. We're going to start scrubbing with our acid resistant wire brush after it starts to foam. The muriatic acid and this wire brush should take most stains like oil right off. When you're done scrubbing the stain, you're going to go ahead and take plain water to rinse the muriatic acid away. Once again, you're going to do it very low to the concrete so it doesn't splash and you're basically going to rinse it away until the bubbles are gone. After your concrete is clean and dry, you can go ahead and apply your epoxy coating. As you can see, our stain is gone. I'm now going to tell you about a second way that you can clean your concrete before applying epoxy. This way involves using your safety gear, your respirator, and your safety goggles, an industrial sander, and anywhere between 60 and 600 grit sandpaper. The way that you would determine what to use on your concrete is if it's a smoother surface that isn't very dirty, uh, possibly a newer concrete, you can use a smoother, higher grit like a 600. If it's really dirty and you think needs a lot of etching, you would use a much uh, rougher grit like a 60. After you're done sanding your floor with your industrial sander, you're going to go ahead and take your vacuum. You're going to vacuum up all the dust after that's done. Your floor is now ready for your epoxy flooring coating. You can find our 321 epoxy resin along with other products, great information, and some videos at aeromarineproducts.com.